To further improve the country's ability to detect aircraft and aerial domain and situation awareness of the Philippine Air Force, the service has requested for the acquisition of additional air surveillance radar systems to cover more areas of the Philippines as part of their Horizon 2 modernization program. The goal is to fill in gaps in the POF's capability to detect aerial activities in the northeastern, eastern, southeastern, central, and southern parts of the country. Originally, the plan was to acquire three fixed radars and two mobile radars. However, it was changed into three fixed and one mobile radars. According to Max Defense Philippines, changes were made to allow Japan Mitsubishi Electric Corporation offer of three JFPS 3ME air defense radar and one JTPS P14ME mobile radar system. After the re-inclusion of Japanese Mitsubishi Electric offer, POF Daysat revised their recommendation, which is now in favor to them. In return, Japan has offered to assist the Philippine Air Force in building up its communications and electronic countermeasures systems, as well as assisting in improving the POF's operational procedures and doctrines. On February 18, 2020, Special Allotment Release Order was released amounting 525,821,400.00 pesos, which is equivalent to 10% of the project's contract price. Last March 3, 2020, Department of National Defense released the notice of award in favor of Japan's Mitsubishi Electric Company to supply air surveillance radar. Planned signing of contract was expected at end of May, but it was stalled due to COVID-19 pandemic. Mitsubishi JFPS-3 ME Air Defense Radar is improved version of JFPS-3, which currently in service of Japan Ground Self-Defense Force since 1990. It features advanced 3D full ESA air surveillance radar with state-of-the-art TR modules, high reliability based on 25-plus years of field-proven use in JFPS-3 radar equipped with modernized components, and easy expandability which includes module upgrade, and flexible mode design. On the other hand, JTPS P14 Me mobile radar system is improved version of JTPS P14, which is also currently in service of Japan Ground Self-Defense Force. It features 360-degree rotatable electronic vertical scan mobile radar, cutting-edge solid-state technology and software signal processing, operationally proven in various environment, snow, typhoon, humidity, sunshine, and sand, quick deployment, and can be transported using C-130 or CH-14. If contract is concluded, this will be the first export of domestically produced defense equipment by Japan after its government lifted the ban on the export of arms and related technologies in 2014.